New at noon, Michigan State University police are releasing updated information about last month's mass shooting. Today we're learning more about what was written in a letter by the gunman before he took his own life. 13 on your side's Keely Levern is in our newsroom now and Keely authorities say the note contains disturbing details. Yeah, absolutely. And even in their release, investigators did warn people who may be reading that note that new information could be upsetting for some. And here's what we've learned today. Anthony McRae left MSU's campus around 826 p.m. that night. Thousands of 911 calls came into dispatch from all over the campus. And when officers finally located him miles away, McRae shoots and kills himself. Authorities say when they found him, there was a note in his pocket. Today, they've released the contents of that note, which says he felt lonely and lost and that he felt like he was an outsider. It also says he was working with a group of 20 other people to carry out more attacks. Investigators have determined that to be untrue and that McRae was acting only alone. And just last week, we learned that the three students who were killed in the shooting, 20-year-old Alexandria Verner, 19-year-old Arielle Anderson, and 20-year-old Brian Frazier will all receive posthumous bachelor's degrees in their field of study from Michigan State University. And the school says they will have resources available on campus as this new information may be difficult for staff and students. Authorities also released a more detailed timeline of the events that night, and you can read that all on our website at 13onyourside.com.